because usually you might have enough cooldowns to reveal one or two people, but you you would you will definitely not have enough cooldowns to reveal four people or four separate times uh, during the middle of a late game team fight. Because usually you have to use all your cooldowns just to force him to heal in the first place. So he's healing when your cooldowns are mostly down. The 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 double investing is a big big part of it for sure. The battle begins in 10 seconds. Five, four, Jin said your Brightwing three, build is Monka? Two, yeah, it was, uh, one. it was a Dono build. <laughs> I would not play that build uh, if I was only trying to win either. <coughs> I play a lot of Dono builds that are Monka. The viewer chooses the build. Did they pick Stitches after I picked Medivh or before? Because if they picked it after, it was pretty boosted, though. Oh okay, shit, we have Artanis main tank, Pago. Good work with Medivh. <coughs> Down. BBJ down has been called. Oh, BBJ down has been called. Or key hunting for or key hunting for some BBJ. Looks like. armor for four seconds sounds kind of good too. I'm not gonna lie. It will not sound bad. The Ravens is so broke. Raven only? Alright. Raven only. I'm down. He's not even stacking. I thought he was stacking. Go for Nine three seconds three CD, two charges. Also a lot better than ten Only second, two charges. It. Enough of this charades. Bring down the That's only one second better though, right? You don't get both blink kills back at once. You, it's just one at a time. So you get one every nine seconds, I'm assuming. Oh, <laughs> one was too slow to take the door. Rip that guy. <clears throat> What's the difference between my E and the, my two? Um. If you press E, it portals from yourself, right? So I pressed E there, so the, the first portal spawns on me, always. It's from me to targeted location. If you press 2, you can spawn the first portal anywhere. So if I press E here, first portal's from me, but the 2 lets me drop the first portal everywhere, anywhere I want. So you're, you, gain, you gain infinite more flexibility with where your portal 
where your portals can be because you can choose the starting location. Yeah, that's fair, Roku. Still fighting up there? What the hell? Once more, the altars rise from the depths. The thing, dude. Thank you. The time is now, yours. Claim the altars in my name. This red. Uh oh, spaghettios. Oh, Pago. gonna go polymorph dude we'll just have two bright wings man i'm playing full bright wing this game polymorph check invisible friends at 20 check call me bright wing baby double bright wing game double bright wing game So that was a good example of uh, why portal mastery was good. I don't know if you saw, but I was over here, but I start my portal where my team is, right? My portal entrance started where my team is, even though I'm all the way back here. That's an example of why portal mastery is really good. Whereas if I didn't have it, I would have to start my portal back here, which, uh, you know, you can't catch someone over there if you're over here. I'm supposed to reach level 20? I'm, I mean, I told you if I play with Divas, I don't know if I'm reaching Pony. I did warn you. I'll try to run it down. Try my best. Let's see what we can do. I'm trying, guys. I'm trying. Not working so far, though. No, BVJ's in there, so close, but I can't get him. Should I go damage level 16? I'm down, dude. It's a damage level 16 Q game. Fly over the core, enemy core. Yeah, you can, but as soon as you dismount, you just get kicked out, so you can't do anything in there.
I want the level 16 damage talent. I don't do enough damage right now. Baby Rage. <coughs> Only top damage by 2k. We need more. Take the altars and put an end to the grave keeper. You lost this one, Raven. It will not be your last. I will endeavor to return. W build, auto build. You mm. have done well. Oh no! I was trying to make sure I, I didn't misclick so I make sure I get my thing I wasn't watching. That's my beat. Maybe then we'll get to tw maybe maybe with that we'll get to 20? I doubt it. I think they need like another two more of those for us to get to 20. We're still too far ahead. It's a disaster. Level 20 secured? I don't think it is. They are still really far behind. We'll see though. Uh, not the first time I've come back from the dead. The core is over half health. Yeah, but if we win one fight right now, it's um it's like um almost their entire life. <laughs> Yeah, we got the extra damage. Look at that, the crit kickers. Crit kickers are the best thing about this game. Not this time, buddy. I'm paying attention this time. I love me some crit kickers. Bah! Oh, I was hoping he would spread it to all of them. I'm the most important one here. Everyone else can suck it. I must live. The rest of you can die. Holy shit! I did infinite damage, but it was not enough. Fake damage! This needs another buff. At least make it like 25%, man. Only 15? It's a scam. Ooh, now we might make 20, though. Maybe we'll make 20 now. I never heal after Q7. That's fine. I think this one sucks. That's why, because it sucks. It's like not even that easy. Because Medivh's auto attack damage is low. Like Talents like these are just like a huge noob trap. Because, because people see like 50%, they're like, oh my god, 50%? That's like a lot of percents, but like, when it says percent, then what matters is your base damage, okay? It doesn't matter if this number is high or low, right? It's like Murky's 9,000% extra damage on your Octograb. Well, the base damage is 3, so, you know, it's still like not that impressive. Meh, because the base damage is 3. Meh. So since your base damage, your base damage auto attack is really low, 50% increase is not that impressive. It's not that much more damage. <coughs> How does this suck? Okay, your next basic attack does 50% more damage. So my next basic attack does right now, it will do like, I don't know, 80 more damage per basic attack. So 80 more damage per basic attack. But this one, Arcane Explosion, this one can do like 1000 thousand damage in an AoE, depending on how much damage you protect. Probably won't do 1000, but I've seen it do like 6-700 in an AoE. So would you rather have 60 damage on your auto attack if you hit your Q, or would you rather have like a 700 damage AoE nuke? It's pretty obvious which one is better, I think. 
Oh, we might actually get to 20 this time, boys. I'll go. Your time is ending, Raven Lord. Healing for 80 and auto is pretty bad. Yep. It's not that good. Question is, how many times do you actually manage to nuke the enemy? Oh, I managed to nuke the enemy almost every W. The more damage you protect, the more damage it does, right? So it's like the Brightwing thing. It's perfectly synergistic with the skill. You want to be using protect at the moment in time when they're taking the most amount of damage. So I managed, I get the 600, 700 nuke pretty often, I think. Even if you don't get 6 700, like let's say even if you get 200, like even a 200 AoE is better than a 60 auto attack. <coughs> you know what I'm saying? Fighting? I'm hella down to fight this man. Well, that was a really good swap. That was fun. I'm going in. Oh, we can make our whole team invisible. The altars have risen. Um, invis team gink bago. They don't know. They don't know. Invis team gink bago. How the hell? How did we die? Where's our team? Oh, it's a top kick, dude. As expected of a cobbler, just kind of <laughs> just humping me, dude. As expected of a cobbler. Oh, they capped it? What the hell? Rip. Keep destroyed. <laughs> I didn't figure it out. People giggly. <coughs> AFK? We're owning! What you mean we're AFK? It was a free invis gink, baby! What's the cast range on this? It's not amazing. I guess it's okay. It's not like the worst. That was a 650 AOE uh, explosion right there. So you can see you you do get it pretty often. You can play into it too, like you know, easiest to do what I just did there. Like you know, ain't nobody in Storm League gonna stop damage on you. So sometimes I'll just portal into their whole team, protect myself, and then keep running into their whole team. <laughs> Because I know they'll just hit me as much as they can. Your powers will be a brave keeper, like all the others. Yeah, I think the problem with this is it's just like, I don't know, man. It's harder to... I don't know. It feels a lot harder to use than Brightwing's Blink Heal. It feels just not easy to use it. 
I never feel like I get great opportunities to use it. High skill cap? I don't. Yeah, I would say it is high skill cap, but like um, 